It is time for What's Trending. Yes. I love this part of the show. Oh, As we yeah. all know by now, our guests will get a minute to debate five of the trending topics wow. from the week in the world of football. Let's so, what is our first topic, Joe? The what? first topic about is wow. Ashley Cole, retired from football this week. Roma obviously tweeting that famous Ashley Cole Choo. photo. They <laughs> struggling to get into a team photo. Uh, but Ashley Cole... Was he the best player of England's golden generation when you look back now? Ooh, OK, 60 seconds on the clock is there. Foods, do you want to kick us off? Nah, man. No? Nah, bruv. Nah. 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 Who, was nah. Who was it then? What, gold, the golden generation? Yeah. Best player. Stevie G? Yeah, you can't give it to Ashley Cole. I mean, I there was... he's up there, you know. Oh, there's so many nah. people. Nah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Gerard, Lampard, Beckham. Yeah, Skulls. I'm sorry. Scores. Yeah. Scores, oh, he's man. at the, oh, he's yeah. at the back. At the back. There's a lot of people before him, though. Yeah. There is. What I would argue, though, is that in his position, you look at the Gerard Lampard, there was, there was other world-class midfielders from other countries. I would say Ashley Cole, okay, in right. his position at that time, was the best left-back in the world. We had Rooney, we had Owen. You could argue there were better strikers in the world. Obviously, Gerard Scholes. It was an unbelievable team. It's true. But was he the only person in the team who was the best in his position, Zou? When you say it like Ooh, that. Ooh, yeah. The way you've put it towards us. The way he's getting... Yeah. Have I changed it's your very, opinion the based on that? It's the way he's worded it, it? No, it's like... it, no it, that's a good point. To see, what, his position in the world, he was definitely at the top level. He was one of the best in the world. But yeah. comparing him to the rest of his peers, who would I rather have him on There's your minute over. There you go. Let's all have a name, then. A name from you? Skulls. Skulls? Uh, Gerard. Gerard? Yeah, I would say Gerard. Gerard. Yeah, okay, yeah. Skulls. Good first topic, Joe. I like that. What, so, topic two, um, I think I'm very much looking forward to. Can yes. Let the viewers it, know what it is, It's please? Timu Puki. Here we go. Um, oh, so, on social media before the season started, uh, I was... I was running my mouth a little bit, I'm not, I'm not going to lie. Uh, what a surprise. Uh, yeah, I, I, I said Timu Puki wouldn't get five Premier League goals yep. this season. No, Joe, you said so, that. Can you just yeah. remind us how many he currently has? He's got four in After two games. games. He's got two? four in two right. games. Wow. He's, got four in, he's got four in two games. Uh, <laughs> but he started the season as well <laughs> with a hat-trick, of course. The Catalan King tweeted this week, Premier League games, Cristiano Ronaldo, 196. Timu Puki, two. Hat-tricks, one. A piece, obviously. Uh, yeah. The real goat showing how it's done in the Premier League. <laughs> He's better than Ronaldo, is that what you're saying? I, I, I'm holding an L here. 100%. This yeah. is bad. Bad for me. Yeah. I shouldn't, had, I shouldn't have run my mouth. Had you never seen him play before? I'd seen him play a couple of times. I just didn't think he'd make the step up. Oh, yeah. you're crazy. I just didn't think he'd make the step up. Step up. So what is Trent but then? I want to know... How many is he going to score this season? Is he going to get more than five? What, what do you boys make? <laughs> the yeah, graphic yeah. says, I'm, I'm is TV Pookie getting more than five 20 goals? 20 goals. That's a 20. No, oh, that's a 20. No, he's got mad. four. No, he's mad. Got so, mad. Four. I'm with you, I'm with you. I'm 20 with you. goals. 20, 20 goals. He's Nor 20 he's Norwich's, goals. Do you know what it is? He's, he's obviously Norwich's main scorer, but... Yeah. Did you see his goals? Yeah, yeah. mad, didn't it? They're That's good. They are quality they goals. They were strikers' goals, weren't they? Yeah. Well? yeah. 20 like, goals. Even the one against Liverpool. When he... When he, he yeah, yeah. Top yeah. scorer he was last good, season man. He's was good. Aubameyang 14, and that. There was that 21? So 20, 20, 20, three of them, yeah. Fourteen. Yeah. It was Aubameyang, Salah and Mane. There was a lot of goals all over the place. So you're saying he's in contention for a golden boot? I don't know about golden boot because I feel that Sadio Mane is the golden boot receiver this year. But... <laughs> yeah, I, I can see. He scored four. He's got yeah. 36 games left. I'm you telling know? you. I can't believe I he's said that. How many do you think he'll score? 14. Four, very exact amount, that, isn't it? 14. <laughs> so specific. Very quick and exact. 14, 14 20, P money, what are you saying? I'm saying, yeah, 18, 20. He's from Finland 18, as well. Wow. Yeah. 18. So we all agree, Joe, that you're an idiot. <laughs> With that, more than five <laughs> Yeah. Uh, I, I'll take it. I, I am looking like a right idiot. Uh, moving on, though. Trend number yeah. three. That's Philippe true. Coutinho. Yes. Joined Bayern Munich on loan wow. this week from Barcelona, That's didn't he? Some Liverpool fans digging him out mm. on Instagram here, saying, uh, leaves Liverpool to join Barca and win trophies. Liverpool win the Champions League, mm. and then he gets loaned away from the club he left for. Right, we have Thoughts. got to start with Big Zoo. Can we have 60 seconds on the clock for our next trend? There it is, Big Zoo. You were shaking your head. Let's go. Poor. Poor. Poor from Coutinho. Yeah? Poor. You should have come back. You should just come back. Come back. <laughs> Klopp, didn't want, Klopp didn't want him. Didn't they didn't want him. There's no more space for him. But, just, you know, that, Bayern. Yeah, that, that face and the veneers, everything about it, it just looks like <laughs> it looks like he's lying. Yeah, I know yeah, he's yeah, like, yeah, just because yeah. of his teeth. They yeah, have I'm having a nice, yeah. but you know inside you can see he's having there's a sad. A, there's another picture. Oh, like he looks, he so looks if you met like people like that you said having a nice, but you don't think they are, and it no, is there's one plenty of people you meet and all that like, you're right, had a good day, yeah. Mate, they're not having a good day. You know, you can see it in their soul. How do you think you'll do it by him? No. No. I don't, nah. I'm not having it. Nah, it doesn't work, bro. He's playing Hoffenheim away in that. Nah, I'm watching uh, Gladbach. Nah. 
Yeah, but I think yeah, I think he's I think he's still a fantastic player. Yeah, but like, he's gonna he's gonna like buy and crush that league every mm. season. He is gonna just be another part of a crushing team. Nah, Sancho and but D- 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 Dortmund have different plans this yeah. year. You, you think? think? Yep. Yeah. Dortmund for the league, so and they're aging a bit, but I don't know. I don't think so, Maybe man. Mm, okay. Bro, how are Robin and Ribery still playing? Gone they now, left. They left. They left. They left. But I mean, like, how are they playing for so long? I don't yeah. know. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Way right, too long. So, Philip Coutinho, that's the end of that one. Yes, yeah, so let's move Not on to trend number four. Uh, this one's about Manchester United. It comes off the back of that brilliant Monday night football debate, yeah. by the way, between Jamie Carragher and the man on your screen <coughs> right now. Gary Neville, looking interesting <laughs> there. Uh, Carragher actually made that his profile picture. And then he went on to destroy Brilliant. Gary Neville again, this time wow. on his Instagram, swapping him out for Jim's dad from American Pie there. Obviously <laughs> saying they look very similar. Uh, but if we go on to that debate, by the way... What, who he looks like? Not, not who he looks like. Uh, they were talking basically about Pogba taking the penalty and missing it against yeah. Wolves. Oli Gunnar Solskjaer came out after the game and said Pogba and Rashford are both our designated penalty takers. They decide on the pitch who takes it. So is it right to have two penalty takers or should it just be one penalty taker when he steps out? Food, let's start with you. 60 seconds on the clock. Should teams have one designated penalty taker? I think just logically one makes it easier. So I'd do one. Just logically. I don't know. I think one is good, but you've got to have players that are there for different times. Like, whoever's feeling it the most, man. No, nah, man. Wild, you don't think man. so? Easy, I think you man. just that's have... Exactly that's what that's pretty said, much yeah, what yeah. Solskjaer said, to be fair, yeah? yeah. No, nah, man. I feel like you, you know your, your main penalty taker and then, obviously, you got your backup. I think my, my issue as a Man United fan is that Rashford has never missed a penalty. Yeah. He's taken yeah. him against PSG, he's taken him against Netherlands in the Columbia? Nations League. Colombia in that penalty yeah. shootout. And the week before against Pogba Chelsea. Pogba has missed four in the last 12 months. So oh, wow. I just don't get why he's taking it off a player that scored the week before with a penalty. Did he take it off him or...? Were they, were they Rashford, Rashford had the ball. Rashford Rashford had the ball yeah. and, were they both David penalty is. takers last season? They were both penalty takers last both season. Both taking penalties. But... Yeah. Mm. It was more Pogba. Pogba took more penalties. And I think Pogba as well, what you have to say, was, was having a fantastic game. Yeah, yeah, like Man yeah. United's best player, as he pretty much is oh, every single thing. week. I just think I, I think it should still have been Rashford, but the criticism Pogba's got is just ridiculous off the bat. Yeah, yeah, oh, that's what I would say. They're moving mad. Okay. Uh, let's go okay. on then to trend number five, shall yeah. we? This one is about Newcastle United. It comes off the back of a David Pick tweet. He said... All these people calling us fickle for wanting Steve Bruce to not be in our job after two games have no idea how we're thinking. We wanted him out after two <laughs> seconds. <laughs> not two games in. And Janet replied, didn't want him when he was a rumour. Shout out Janet for that that's one. Harsh, uh, our Newcastle wow. fans, though, being too harsh. Pima, okay. you say it's too harsh? Yeah, that's harsh, man. That's harsh. I think it's everyone... Terrible start, though. Yeah, it is a terrible start, but everyone needs a chance. I think it's harsh, man. It's definitely harsh yeah, to say that. Man. Two games. Yeah, man. Is he yeah. from Newcastle? Like, is... He, he, he's his boyhood club. Boy's his boyhood club, club yeah, he has sorry. also... He's managed Sunderland managed as well. Sunderland. Yeah, yeah. I know, man. But I feel like he's got the passion for the, for the squad. <clears throat> they're not in the best position right now. They need all they can get, man. They yeah. need the help. Obviously, they're very sad to see Rafa go. Do you think that's what it is? Mm. Because Rafa was a Champions yeah. League yeah. winning yeah. manager. Yeah. They, they see it as a, a step down. Yeah, no man. disrespect to Steve Bruce. Yeah. yeah. Bruce, what, yeah. what do you think? Steve Bruce, right man for you or not for nah, Newcastle? For nothing. I like him, but yeah. I wouldn't for want nothing. him at my club. <laughs> no? Yeah. I like. Obviously, I like Steve's a good lad. They're like a yeah, yeah, guy, yeah. innit? Like, yeah, yeah. like, you, I want him to be my uncle, maybe. Yeah. But, like, not manager of my football club. Yeah, I can see where Newcastle fans are coming from. Okay. It's kind of tough. Five seconds left. So, are they being too harsh, P Money? Yes or no? Yeah. Harsh. Give him a chance. Nah. No for you. <laughs> Give him a chance, man. Give him a chance. Okay, good last topic, that, Joe. Yes. Like that. Good topics. Right, okay. And of course, Newcastle play Spurs. That is uh, Super Sunday tomorrow. The mighty Spurs Come against Newcastle. Yeah, I thought you'd be disappointed. Are they playing at home in the stadium? Tottenham Hotspur Stadium, yeah. Stadium. It's a good stadium, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. amazing it's a stadium. stadium. It's an amazing stadium. It amazing is live. Stadium. They'll be playing yeah. there tomorrow. Um, Are you going to go? I am. Not. I can't go because I've I'm got going. furniture oh. arriving. I'm uh, going yeah. too. I'm going. So we're there. not even Spurs fans. <laughs> I support the stadium. I, I, I can't go because I've just moved house, got furniture arriving, which I've got to be there. Oh, I'm going to watch you guys in the game to have furniture delivered. We've got to move on, Joe. Uh, <laughs> I'm going in the game. Big Spurs fan, but I can't unfortunately make it. Anyway.